Hi, welcome to Laura's View and Tarot 2. I am so glad you're here. Today's date is Friday, December 29th, 2023. I'm glad I'm here. There was nothing wrong with me in the interval that I wasn't making videos. It was just a very busy time um, trying to move into a house that still had some active renovations going on and having some holidays with a three-year-old to make them memorable for. So as much as I wanted to be here and checking in with you folks, family and um, personal situations did take a priority for a few days. I appreciate your patience. Um, I'm back. <laughs> and I'm still going to ask for a little bit of your patience because I'm trying to get a uh, this set up as a permanent place to make videos where I won't have to set up and dismantle every time like I've had to in the past but I don't have everything unpacked, but I felt like today I had enough unpacked that we could go ahead and do a video, but the lighting might not yet be ideal. The acoustics might not be as good as I can get them, but I've always said this is a home production and that's not going to change. And uh, so let's get to it, okay? <laughs> There's a new um, site out that people have been writing me about and asking, should they be giving it any notice? Is it a distraction? Is it uh, something to watch and give some validity to? Well, now, if you've been following me any length of time, you know that I always advise using, accessing any information stream that seems to interest you, but use your discernment. The 17 team has always said no outside communications. That doesn't mean, though, that other people might not have mold over situations and um, had some insights to share that can be valid or can add to your knowledge base. So let's go to a quick compilation I've got that will let you know what I'm talking about as carefully as possible. And we're going to ask the cards if this um, <clears throat> site has validity and uh, advice about spending time and energy on what they're putting out. I've heard it said that uh, they're going to be selling things there. I didn't find information that would confirm that, um, but that's something always to watch for. So here's my uh, share screen, one second. All right, now <laughs> they have claimed the domain of this official.net and it talks about coming soon. That doesn't make them official just because they put official in the title. Want to be very clear here. If you go to X or Twitter, you can find a site that seems to have most of what they're putting out here also. So there's that for you. This is a sample of some of the items that have gone up use always with some kind of a countdown <clears throat> the first one or two countdowns just seem to reset with uh, a new title so people wondered you know is there are there things going on in the background that this is giving us disclosure about is it a distraction what's going on okay currently they're claiming that something big is coming to a lot of big cities around the planet so Let's ask the universe for insights and information about that site. Specifically, should there be um, just insights and information I'm looking for is the site uh, a valid place to get information about. And with the insights and information, we'll find out that for sure. Personally, as interested as we are in politics, I do think that it's good to limit our time and energy on those and focus our time and energy. Um, it's good to keep a you know pulse point on it, but keep our time and energy focused on some big events, some world changes, things like that. And politics are, are part of it, but not, I don't think, the main element. 
Okay, I'm going to switch the camera so you can watch me work with the cards. And we'll see what the universe wants us to know about this site and uh, whether they're actually distributing information that we should be paying close attention to and countdowns we should be getting excited about, etc. Okay, so again, that site, Insights and Information, and uh, looking especially at uh, valid and useful information that we should be getting excited about, countdowns we should be getting excited about, or uh, just what does the universe advise? Okay, we've got the Seven of Pentacles, Four of Wands, Strength card, Ace of Pentacles, ooh, the Tower, Seven of Swords, Death. Okay, we have three out of seven cards or major arcanas. It's a question the universe was anxious to give us some information about. Now, the situation involved here is, uh, it does look like we've got a yes, that there is some um, reason to be excited, excited about that site, to uh, watch what they have, okay, the what they're putting out. And there does seem to be some information stream coming to us from them, if not directly from that team, possibly um, closely related to the team. The, uh, however, be aware that, uh, first of all, <laughs> the information they're putting out is only part of what's going on a little bit. Just They're just little snippets and nuggets, little teasers. And uh, at the core of it, they're, while they're sharing information, there is a profit motive to that site. So be careful um, as you spend time there. And just kind of know that somebody is uh, profiting from doing that site. It's not being done um, from a place of altruism and uh, uh, no thought of gain or profit. Now, whether someone is simply subsidizing the process, I don't see that here yet. Uh, it could just be that it's subsidized. You know, it, it costs money to keep a, a website up. So there's no harm in needing some funds, but it does look up there's something of a profit motive going on with that, which would not be aligned with the precepts that have always been part and parcel of that team. Okay, now let's look in the past. Uh, we've got the strength card showing up in the recent past. So yeah, there, there is some big events that are coming and it was time to uh, get a little excitement. People were getting a little weary and discouraged. And so they felt like they were in a position of strength that they could disclose some little countdowns and things and keep people watching. It's not necessarily a distraction as much as it's meant to be an encouragement to see that there are some uh, countdowns going on. And again, those are, if you remember that this, uh, changes coming to our world is more of a military type of thing. And those are based on objectives met, not so much a calendar. But knowing that in the civilian world, it's calendars and countdowns, that's why that has become an element of what is part and parcel of that site. Now let's look at the near future. There are some big events coming and some of those are being um, hinted at uh, with those countdowns. Absolutely, but be aware, <laughs> there is some, there's some, um, one of the things also that 17 has always said is that disinformation is necessary. So some of those countdowns um, have nothing to do with what is going on. It may be to cause some worry on the parts of the opposition, what have you. Um, and the uh, further insight about these big events, we've got the depth card showing up, which is about slow changes coming about. So some of these some of these things that they're talking about have been a long time in the works. 
there's still uh, in the near future uh, quite a possibility. But again, don't spend too much time and energy with that site because there is a little misdirection involved. There does seem to be something of a profit motive. So I'd be careful about that because truly aligned with uh, 17, that is not going to be an issue. Let's get a couple more cards and see if there's further insights looking at the near future and what is being put out by that uh, site. Again, we've got a little smoke and mirrors, lots of choices going on here. So there is some elements of truth to those countdowns, to those items they're talking about, but it's not the sum total of it. So again, be very careful. The uh, um, Nine of Pentacles also showed up here, which is a beautiful card. Again, while Pentacles tend to be assets and tangible goods, this card is also a card of independence and uh, it's, it's good. So it does look like some of their motives um, can be, while there is a profit or at least a sponsorship element to that uh, website, some of what they're doing is in the best uh, possible um, fashion. So that's what the cards are telling us. And again, with three major arcanas, it was a topic the universe was ready, willing, and uh, interested in and wanting to share with us. So let's recap. We looked at, with careful wording, <laughs> a website that's doing lots of countdowns and asked if there was uh, any insights and information that the universe had for us about that site. Uh, could, especially with an eye to, could we give some of what's being read there a little bit of notice, attention, and even a little anticipatory excitement? We got a yes with the Ace of Pentacles. So that was good. And then uh, uh, it does look like from a position of strength, that was a recent past, kind of talking about how this uh, site came to be. I think there was an acknowledgement that in the civilian world, uh, where we work on calendars and countdowns, that those would give a little bit of excitement to the civilian population. Um, not too much, folks, because again, we're looking at a, for objectives, not so much a calendar day or time. And if the prerequisite objectives haven't been met, we don't want them to say, oh, good enough. We want this planet and this plane of existence to be cleared and cleansed and uh, healed and grown and <laughs> headed the way it needs to be, not with a good enough band-aid on it, but with a ready to go, let's do it type of thing. The uh, We do have a near future card of the tower showing up. So there are some big events coming and that site is talking about some big events in uh, some major cities. So it does look like there, there may be some validity to that. We'll have to watch and see. Um, and again, you know, we're kind of constrained too because there are things that the uh, mainstream media deliberately chooses not to share. But there are enough uh, civilians out there with access that uh, a lot of times word does trickle out, does trickle out. Um, as always, be careful. There's a little bit of misdirection involved with this. And the uh, team has always told us to that disinformation is necessary. And that's part of what's going on with that site, but not all of it. So uh, again, the, the White Hats, the Alliance that have been listening to the civilians that are saying, we need something. We need we need something visible. We need something public. We need to know things are going on. This is part of an answer to that. But again, with what looks to be something of a profit motive or, um, and I don't yet know if that's simply that, uh, that someone is being subsidized to do that. And again, there are necessary costs involved with keeping a website going. So that may, that may be it. I'm not going to say that they are grifting at all. Uh, we'll just see what they, as time goes on, if there are, uh, um, calls for support or things being offered for sale or things like that, then that'll kind of tell us that, oh, it was a little more than just uh, um, a subsidized uh, type of project. 
which no harm in that. So again, use your discernment. Be careful where your attention goes. It's fine, as I've always said, to listen to everybody. Look at any information that interests you. Do it with your discernment. And the more you do, the stronger that discernment is going to get. And that's what it's all about. That's why um, I will never tell you absolutely have nothing to do with uh, this information stream or that topic or what have you. <laughs> so that's up to you to decide what you put in your brain and what stays there. <laughs> So that's it for this video. Again, um, I thank you for your patience while I was gone. And I thank you for the patience uh, with the uh, still developing acoustics and lighting going on here at the new place. And until next time, which will be tomorrow, because I plan to do, go back to a daily schedule as much as possible. So uh, with, after that absence, it's the least I can do. So until next time, I wish you love and light and everything bright. Bye.